Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I do apologize for the lighting. I can't do anything about it at this stage. I, um, it's just extremely hot uh, in Australia at the moment. I can't really open the blinds or turn on lights or I will overheat. Um, I just wanted to come on here and quickly discuss why I'm not supporting Jeffree Star anymore. Um, and yeah, some of the reasons uh, why. Um, one of the big reasons with Jeffree Star is uh, the way he's conducted himself recently um, and consistently on social media. He has a very reactive way of addressing concerns um, and problems on social media. Um, he seems to get very angry and aggressive and enters into petty arguments extremely easily. Um, I mean, just very recently, there was someone who, I don't condone this behavior, by the way, um, who wanted to promote their makeup uh, and their business. And they decided to post um, their looks under Jeffree Star's tweets when it wasn't relevant. Now, completely understand why Jeffree would be annoyed by that, but I think there could have been a better way of... Um, addressing that instead of saying, oh, you're whoring yourself out for attention. Uh, I don't think that's appropriate to say to such a young kid. Um, I think, you know, it would have probably been better handled with a private DM or um, some a bit more appropriate language uh, for him uh, and for the age of uh, the person. Now, overall, his content has definitely moved away from the traditional uh, content he used to make. He used to make a lot of favourites videos. Um, he used to genuinely discuss makeup products he enjoyed at, on a personal level. Um, I'm finding more and more that he's doing a lot of self-promotion for his brand and his products um, and that he's following hype and doing reviews on products that are very hyped up. Um, and that the younger audience is looking to purchase. Um, so I feel like the content that I originally came to Jeffree Star for is no longer there. Um, and yeah, it's just, I feel like the channel is, the channel, sorry, is for 14 year olds now. It's not for people of my age. Um, so I'm 24. Um, which is kind of sad because I I miss the mellow, more chill Jeffrey when he was just sitting down and doing his makeup and doing a tutorial or just sharing his favourites and chilling with Nathan um, and just being there and present and just being very chill and himself. I feel like he hypes up his personality way too much online now. I feel like we're not seeing the real Jeffree Star. I feel like we're seeing the shell and the outer casing, so to speak, um, and his defense mechanisms. Um, and I think it's definitely a product of, you know, the drama last year with Manny, uh, MUA and Laura Lee um, and Nikita Dragon and all those types and, you know, how that whole situation unfolded. And once again, I don't support any of those guys either. I think what they did was wrong. Um, and I don't support Thomas Halbert either or anyone like that. Um, so I think Jeffrey is justified in a lot of things that he does and says, but I think his tact and the way he goes about things uh, could be improved. And another thing I've noticed is Jeffrey Star products have been losing their quality recently as well. I mean, the Thirsty palette was definitely not as good as Blood Sugar. Neither was the Alien palette. Um, there were inconsistencies with, um, you know, patchy uh, shadows and shadows that had too much pigment and weren't blendable. Um, and, yeah, I just don't want to support a brand that's not consistently getting better and better and better with their releases and uh, is keeping the quality at an all-time high. Now, in terms of Jeffree Star as a person, I have the utmost respect for him as a person. 
I just don't feel it's right to put my money um, and my views on YouTube towards him at this stage. I really hope that he can learn and grow as a person and perhaps, you know, bring back the old Jeffrey and the um, more chill, mellow side to him um, and, and not be so reactive online and to focus on his cosmetic brand and his other brands that he uh, is involved in. All right. Now, I may get a lot of backlash for this video. I'm well aware of that, but I just wanted to share my thoughts. And I know that a lot of people do feel the same as me. Um, and yeah, please leave a comment below. Please be respectful of me and also my subscribers and other people that are commenting below. It's not a competition. It's not a game. Um, just be really respectful of each other. All right. So take care. Thanks for watching. Bye.